I hope some pity for me still remains, considering my recent tone, because I'm honestly not sure where we should start. I suppose we should just ask the receptionist to point us to somebody who can answer our questions. Honestly, you do have your own mesh access, yes? I'm quite certain you can handle all the casual searches you might feel like making. We hardly have time for me to blather out every bit of exposition you desire when you could just go look it up on your own. Fair enough. If you think it will save time, I can continue to rattle off these facts when you ask for them. I just ask that you keep your queries to a minimum. We don't have a whole lot of time. Let me pull up the information you requested. TMI Entertainment is a relatively popular celebrity and gossip news conglomerate. They own OK Today. They did a good job transitioning from the traditional media models of television and news to the net-based model prevalent now, pioneered by their digital newspaper, OK Today's The Scanline. Some might call their programs rags, but opinion on the mesh seems more favorable than not. They stick to mostly good nature crying and lean away from the seedier nastiness that paparazzi can get up to. As such, they have a positive relationship with many celebrities and regularly get exclusive scoops that keep their ratings up, despite their refusal to peddle in the darker side of the celebrity news circuit. Charlie Nova is TMI Entertainment's most popular TV personality. He's gotten consistently high ratings for almost a decade and isn't afraid to tell you about it. The chatter on the mesh paints him as a bit arrogant, but in that loud, back-slapping kind of way that a media star can get away with. He's best known for hosting Star in the Stratosphere. It's one of those talent-seeking reality programs. Apparently, when TMI can't organically discover enough celebrities, they just manufacture them. Oh, and also, according to this blog, Charlie's hair is flawless.
head straight there. Because she doesn't like it when people bother the talent. here now what are you doing bothering my people i thought i told nina to cancel all my appointments for the day i swear that girl couldn't find her ears if i taped them over her eyes at least she makes a decent cup of coffee yes i am and if you don't mind i keep the show running here so i'll be brief what are you doing in my building? We've been given a lead on a story that involves one of your personalities, Charlie Nova. Someone has been manipulating his articles on the MeshNet and turning them into scathing attacks against the human revolution. We're trying to track the culprit and we need to talk to Mr. Nova to hunt down further leads. You let your ROM do all the talking for you? Must be one of those new interrogation modules all the fresh meat rave about. Hmm. Of course I know someone's been modifying Charlie's articles. I'm tracking them down myself. What I want to know is why I should help you snatch the scoop out from underneath me. Super hacker twists MeshNet news for personal political vendetta? The clicks basically farm themselves. Not interested. I already have a pretty decent idea of where to look next. And if that doesn't pan out, I have our primary server cluster chewing through mesh posts looking for inconsistencies. I'll figure this one out on my own, without some newbie mucking things up. Ha! <laughs> I'm not hiring, kid. I admire your spirit, but I've got people putting in lots of hours on this one. You're not getting the credit because you think you have a hot lead. Plus, if you really did, you wouldn't be here begging for my scraps. Zin? Augmented eyes, Zin? What does Zin have to do with this? She's the one who gave us the lead to begin with. Then, someone threw her out of her office window. We figured Mr. Nova might be next, and we wanted to get to him first. Holy shit. Fine, I'll let you talk to Charlie. If someone is trying to kill people over this, I'd rather it be out and done with as fast as possible. I mean, shit, we're an entertainment scene. Nobody should die for that. But hey, watch yourself with Charlie. He's a pompous clown, but he's my pompous clown. Keep it civil, or I'll throw your ass out and figure this out on my own. Now get on it. I need to make some calls.
fantastic! How fantastic! I just love your ROM. Not quite as stunning as mine, but still pretty grand. Very sleek, very clean, bravo. Oh, uh, Sympathy is doing that thing where she waves at me to hurry things up. Right down to brass tacks then, I suppose. Wait! I forgot to introduce myself. I'm Charlie Nova, host of Tonight in the Stars and Star in the Stratosphere. But you already knew that, I'm sure. What can I do for you, hmm? Oh, you flatter me. Yes, you do. I can't imagine you've come all this way just to get my story, have you? After all, I've already published my very own splendid 100% original autobiography. Like a Nova. But I suppose I can give you a quick rundown, even if sympathy is giving me the stink eye. I grew up here on the mean streets of Neo SF, but my jocular nature and striking countenance got me scouted for a few small product advertisements. And the rest is not so ancient history. Now I'm the host of the largest celebrity news show on the mesh, and I couldn't be happier. It's all thanks to my swarms of fans, though. They're the ones who count. Yes, any additional information on your station would be greatly appreciated. Well, it's the best damn network on the planet, I can tell you that. We put out top-notch news and entertainment, but with real heart that our competitors just can't match. But if you really want to know about TMI, you need to know about sympathy. It's her pride and joy, after all. Sure, she can be a little acerbic, and sure, she calls me a poofy-haired oaf all the time, but you can really tell she cares, you know? Deep down. Hmm, I'm not sure if that throat-cutting gesture she's making is a signal to move to another topic or a threat against my physical well-being. So, let's move on. What next? Oh, it may have come up in the last lunch meeting we had, but Sympathy assured me that it was some kind of technical glitch, and our support people were on top of it. They're top-notch, the absolute best money can buy. So I don't think there's anything more to say on the subject. That's very upsetting. I hope you've passed along that information to Sympathy. I'm certain our tech people will be able to find the culprit in short order once they know enough about it. I really don't know what I have to do with it, though. <laughs> it's charming. And of course, I'm the leading man around here. Who has said otherwise? I'm not quite certain what you think it is that I don't know, but I assure you that I know what it is. You won't be able to trip me up that easily. Nothing. The tech guys already did an audit on my online presence, and there's no evidence of any attempts of unauthorized access to any of my accounts. That's why they're having a hard time pinning down this creep. He 
isn't actually changing the posts from inside my account at all. So there you go, we're already on top of it. Nothing to worry about at all. All right, that's enough. Charlie has a show to get ready for. He's told you everything he's going to. So get the hell out of here. If you find anything more interesting than what you got, come back and see me again. Directly. Remember, I'm the victim in all this. difficult. Perhaps I could take the coffee over to Sympathy and we could try to smooth her rumpled feathers. Um, yeah, okay, sure. I mean, what's the worst that can happen? Can make her even matter? Oh no. One second thought. It'll only take a minute. She takes it with plenty of milk. to beat it, or do your ears just not work? Ha! Ah, that's cute. I promise I don't bite, I just have a job to do. Sometimes I think Charlie's hair gel seeps into his brain, but he brings in most of our revenue, so his happiness is our top priority. Ugh, my stomach is killing me. Maybe those egg rolls I had earlier. I'm heading to the can, and you're heading to the street. Did you want a signed photo? I'm not quite sure what you're insinuating, but I don't think I like it. I'm a pillar of this community, and I care deeply about our reports getting to the viewer the way they're intended. I assure you that sympathy is on top of the situation, and with that, I'll have to bid you good day. Good God damn, I don't know what's wrong with my stomach. And didn't I tell you to get the hell out of here? You're on my last nerve, and if you wanted to earn a grudge with me, you're just about there. Move! That did not go well at all. We need some kind of leverage to get Mr. Nova to give us the information we want. I'm certain he knows something. Don't you agree? opportunity to look into his history more thoroughly. It turns out he did a series of promos for a local Hassie bar early in his career, and some fans still spot him there from time to time. It's a long shot, but frankly everything about this case has been one long shot after another. Maybe we should question the people at this Hassie establishment and look for any dirt we can use to put some pressure on Mr. Nova. There must be something. It's the only path I see. The 
Massey Bar is located on Market Street, near the Genus Clinic. We can head there whenever you're ready. 